Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Wario Land 2 with MioXFu and we're moving on to the second story. Turn off the giant faucet. So basically from that beginning, um, whatever it's called, that beginning cutscene, now we know that we need to turn off the faucet that w that's wasting all the water and flooding our, flooding our castle, our manor, or whatnot. And we get introduced to a new concept, um basically currents that all, all, all the water in this ep in this story is basically going to be pushing us back to the beginning and we're going to have to use these dressers to get by. I don't know where all the dressers keep coming from because there's quite a lot of dressers in this game. Um, whether it's used for um, floating on floating on water or whether it's just used as an obstacle to get in Wario's way. But it's, it's pretty ridiculous. Before we get going, I am going to collect coins. There's going to be a lot of coin collecting in this game because, as you saw, we use 100 for the treasures and we use 50 to turn over one tile. So, there's going to be a lot of just going back through levels and collecting coins. If there is any grinding that I have to do later on, I'm going to do that off screen. Oh, and we get our second ability. Like I said, there's no dying, so when you get set on fire, you turn into fire yourself. Basically, you can now break through these fire blocks, and until you turn into fire, you saw it, you just move very quickly. You can also get extinguished while you're doing that, but then you turn into actually living fire at the very end. Which, again, gets very complicated l later on because the creators didn't really like the players, it seems. Oh, come on, we can't get up at, up there again. Oh well, not that big of a deal. Alright, fish don't hurt us, they just knock us back. Now you see these grates down here? These are our best friends, because they will actually stop us from going all the way back to the start if we fall in accidentally. But then you see down there, there's also currents that will just screw us over and push us down, trying to keep us from keeping any real progress. Alright. So, let's go in here. I believe this is actually the treasure room. Oh. Yes, it is. Alright, so again, we're gonna do normal. And hope we get it in one try, because I don't have enough for another normal try. Alright, so we're looking for a punch. That's not that bad. He's pretty unique looking. Okay, I think I saw him. Right? Aha! <laughs> yeah, these are all enemies that are going to show up in a little while. Well, well I, I, I really don't like it, because I keep saying, we'll get to them in a little while. <laughs> right, we're going to go... No, 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 come on. Oh. You can jump up um, before the end. If you get close enough to the surface, but... Eh. I didn't want to fall down. Alright, I'm just gonna go over here and then... Oh, come on! I had that! Oh, come on! I had that! You guys can see it, right? Um, I can't really see it because my screen's a little screwed up. It won't... Aha! There we go. There's a secret passageway under here with more coinage. That, again, is just very convenient to have. I hate these... These saw-tooth shark things. They're just really annoying, because once they see you, they'll charge at you like the Zelda snakes, and... Again, it's just really annoying sometimes, but... Oh, come on. All the way back. And hello, fishy. Hello, fishy. Alright, we're done with that headache. Now we can move on to the rest of the real level. And jump, and jump. Alright, another new mechanic. Alright, so you see how this step kind of makes a slope? Well, you press down with Wario, and he rolls into a ball! And... Well, with that fake wall, you have to do it this way. There's no way to actually do it by trying to do a rush a rush jump like that. 
uh, you just end up bouncing off again. And... Oh, maybe you can. I don't know, usually I bounce off the top and I end up having a headache because I fall into the water and then I have to go all the way back again. Yay, another new concept that I get to explain. So you see how these guys won't let us die no matter what. Basically what we gotta do is take them out with another enemy. It's also something else I forgot. You can actually butt stomp and it'll startle the guys for a little while. It'll change the direction that they're walking if it's a punch or a, a pirate move, a pirate goom. Like, see, see, it just changes the direction, which... Ooh! Silver coin. Those appear very rarely, probably like every 5% of the coins that enemies drop is a silver coin, but they're worth 100 regular coins. And you can also... S There's so many things pop popping up at once, so I don't know what to say what to stop and say. You can also see fake walls just by the way that they look a little different. They're a little darker than the regular walls. But anyway, silver coins are a great boon, so grab them whenever you see them. A lot of the larger enemies, um, not like the alarm clock, but there's going to be a few other ones that we see that are considered large enemies, will pretty much drop them by default whenever they die. Ha, there we go. No, 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 no. I just got up there. That's the other thing. If there's a secret area you can't go to, look up. <laughs> there's probably a platform that you can't see. Game developers were an absolute bitch with that in this game. Alright, that's all the coins, so I'm not... Screw those pots. I love the music in this game, by the way. Especially the when you're at the actual... End of the level. Just everything about the music completely encapsulates the mood of Wario as well. Like, we got everything! <laughs> anyway, let's go for the, se the second treasure map piece. And hope we don't screw up. Alright. So there is some amount of gambling you can do here, like I could guess 1, 4, or 7 right now, and I'd probably lose if I guessed 1 or 7, because it's usually the opposite one, but you know what, I'm just going to pay 150 more gold and know that it's 7. And there you go. It's not... It's not like we can't get more money. <laughs> Alright, so I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Wario Land 2 with Mio X Fu. Take it easy.